Hello everybody, this is Ancient Ice, and I am back, this time, with some Sonic Origins. So this is a game that I got recently, um, first when it came out, you know, I had some mixed reviews on Steam, and I thought, well, I'll wait, because these things tend to, uh, these games tend to not be so great when they first release, uh, and it doesn't matter if it's this, Sonic Frontiers, which I still haven't played, and uh, I guess even the, uh... let's see here, <clears throat> and Sonic Colors, which looks like it came out on, on Steam on the 6th, but a lot of the, uh, the issues I think have been addressed with this, and uh, I wanted to get it and play it, and <laughs> I've been playing it quite a bit, to say the least. Now, of course, a lot of these games I've played countless times. You know, my first console was the Sega Genesis. And uh, the original Sonic the Hedgehog was one of the first Sonic games I ever got. And I think, uh, I don't think I had Sonic 2, but uh, I did end up getting Sonic 3 and then eventually Sonic and Knuckles. And Sonic 3 and Knuckles is by far uh, my favorite Sonic game. Which it's actually, I guess, two and one, the way it ended up being made. The story behind that's pretty interesting. But, anyway. Let's see here, get rid of this. Now I can see better. Now one thing that's kind of cool about this, uh, Sonic Origins, they found a way to throw Tails and Knuckles into games they weren't in. Now, of course, Tails was in Sonic uh, 2. But Knuckles, and well, Knuckles was if you put the Sonic 2 cartridge into your Sonic and Knuckles cartridge. But I think it's kind of cool that you could play as Tails and Knuckles in the first Sonic game, too, the way that they did this. And uh, something that's kind of goofy, I guess, is you could play as Knuckles and have Tails as uh, your little follower dude. Personally, I think Knuckles is just a far better character in general. Um, you know, I find him more interesting. I like his mobility, though Tails is a little bit better uh, in most cases. Um, but being able to climb things is pretty cool. And that gliding is top notch. But unlike Tails, Knuckles gets a super form, which I activated right at the end there. Doesn't even matter at that point. So, <clears throat> you might be wondering how the heck I have uh, Super Knuckles this early in the game, first act of Chemical Plant. Honestly, you could get all seven Chaos Emeralds relatively easily uh, within the first, uh, first act, uh, zone. You can get three... I think you can only get three emeralds in the first act. In the second act, you've got five shots at getting the emeralds. And, uh, you know, yeah, you might fail, but you get that one extra chance. And if you're playing this version of the game, you can get those little coins, which you can see I'm maxed out on already. Um, it's just, it's too easy to get those, quite honestly. But... Um, <clears throat> if you fail your bonus level, you can use a coin to try it again. So, at this point, <laughs> it's almost impossible for me to not, uh, get those emeralds. Which is good, because I wasn't very good at them, but, uh, I'll tell you what. Once I got through, because I got these for everyone. Once I got through everybody... It was, I, I was, I was a master at getting those things. Maybe sometime I'll make a video on, uh, how to do that, but really all you need is a map of the zones for the first act, and you've got everything you need. You just have to make sure you've got your 50 rings when you touch those posts. And you're good to go. 
Look at that. Knuckles is climbing like a champ. I love that. Now, I could go super. I don't feel a need to right now. And honestly, sometimes it's better to wait. Especially with Sonic. Because Sonic is so quick. Oh, I'm going to die. All right. Well, never mind. It happens. I should have done this. Unfortunately, I don't need my super form to beat this boss. Though, you know, it could be convenient. Oh, wow. Tails being aggressive. Are you kidding me? Alright, so I am off to a terrible start in this stream but these things happen these things happen it's kind of awkward i almost rather maybe not have tails because i have to worry about when he attacks stuff can i even climb this interesting of course poor knuckles can't jump as high as the other characters and so sometimes you gotta take a little bit of different path thing there Alright, Tails is dead. Nope. Let's not say we did. Alright. <clears throat> God. In fact, that took me more than one attempt, I'll tell you. I like that background. You know, it's easy to not really pay attention, but the backgrounds in the, these games are actually kind of cool, I think. And some of these levels, of course, too, um, <clears throat> they included in uh, Sonic Mania. And they had a little bit more detail. So here's one of those, those instances where Knuckles just can't jump. Just can't jump. So we had to go glide there up the hill. That's okay. Because he can glide. Yeah, let's get those rings. And jump up there, because I don't really like going in the water. Who likes going in the water? Nobody likes water. Well, <clears throat> there is one water level in a Sonic game that I don't hate, and it's in Sonic 3. But, uh... Here, yeah, I'd, I'd prefer to stay out of the water. It's there, but we can avoid it. So, they give you three of those coins just for beating the level. And that's what I mean. It's so easy to get those coins. And you don't use the coins as lives, so you technically have infinite lives in this version of the game. I don't know. I mean, some people didn't like that feature. Others like it. I guess if you're not used to playing these kind of games, you're going to die a lot. Or uh, if you're just going to be terrible, uh, like how I started out. Okay, they fell back down. So they reset when I went off screen. I do think that they went and changed a few things too. Uh, with certain elements of the game in uh, the new mode. Because... I've noticed playing <clears throat> playing through this, I've died to a lot of random stuff. And some of the glitches that I remember being in the game aren't there anymore. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Wait a second. Am I actually trapped? Did they... This is problematic. Ah. Uh... I don't I think I'm I think I'm I'm out of luck here. I think I just got screwed. Yo, what's up, Deku Link? How you doing? I think I'm in jail. I I they they put me in jail. <laughs> we'll just restart. I don't think I've ever done that before. 
And yeah, that kind of sucks, but at the same time, I do find that to be kind of funny. It definitely shows that, uh, you know, Knuckles being in this was kind of an afterthought. Because it didn't make sure. Oh my goodness. But hey, you know what? Some of that, that weird, goofy stuff, thats that adds to some of the charm of these older games, too. Although, uh, I suppose on, you know, depending on how patient of a person you might be, that might not be so charming. I don't know how I didn't die from that. Like, I was right under that when it fell down. I mean, I'm not complaining. I'll take that. A win is a win. There's one of those. Instead of a, a one-up, it's a star up i guess we'll call it all right let's see how badly so this is a little bit different because again knuckles can't jump very well he needs that little booster yeah tails pick up my rings be good for something oh my god i'm not trying to show off here i'm just trying to kill this guy as quick as oh i have to wait till it's in that was my fault I'm getting a little impatient here, just trying to kill off Robotnik. Tails, you just... Why? Why, bruh? Why? Might have been easier if I just, uh, put this in solo. Very nice. I've beat a lot of this game. Um... I was playing it a lot earlier today. Um, you know, when I wasn't so busy with work, uh, we'll say. But, uh, made a lot of progress with it. But I want to see if I can beat it with all of the, uh, the characters. And, uh, you know, back in the day, you know, I had a Sega Genesis. I was able to play this, but I never had Sonic 2. So the only time I really got to play Sonic 2 was on, uh, like, some of the remakes they made. But I don't... <sighs> not really sure that Knuckles was really in any of them. So, kind of cool getting to play this uh, with Knuckles in it. I kind of missed the... Uh... Well, at least for the Sonic 3 and Knuckles part of this, uh, Sonic Origins. kind of wish they could have actually gotten, like, the uh, original soundtrack for the game. Because it just, it just does not feel right with, uh, some of the replacement tunes that they put in there. It really doesn't. I mean, I get it. Michael Jackson helped them with the uh, the soundtrack, and there's some stuff going on there. But you know, I guess it's better that we we get something than nothing at all. Because I don't, yeah, you know, we haven't had Sonic Three and Knuckles on uh, one for a while. Yeah, Sonic Three. I don't know if there were any tracks with him and and Knuckles. Um, or Sonic and Knuckles part of the game, but I know the Sonic 3, uh, they replaced a lot of the, the tracks. You know, they're not the original. And I mean, they're okay, but, I mean, maybe it's nostalgia, maybe they're just better done. But I really like the original tracks in 3. So the replacement ones they used here i think the worst canned one that they they used to replace those tracks was the one for launch base because i just listened to that and i'm like i don't know i don't think that's i don't think that was the original i could be wrong but i'm pretty sure launch base had a different track oh my gosh <clears throat> oh yeah, I can just climb. What am I doing? What am I doing? Yeah, man, a hundred points. I just gotta do that like a hundred times. 
to actually get something for it. <clears throat> I guess I could do this. I haven't really been using his uh, super form. Oh my gosh. Which is one of the reasons why. Oh my. There's a little bit of a delay there because Tails has to release on it too. It's kind of bad when the AI that's supposed to be there helping you is actually making the job harder, but eh, you know, whatever. I get to have Tails following Knuckles, which is kind of weird. Hi, everyone. Yep. Yeah, I I got all of the emeralds on all of them. I have a file for each of them, beat the game with them. I actually did most of that last night. I get the blue spears. Oh man, that was like that's probably my favorite mini game to do for the Chaos Emeralds out of all the games. I used to do perfects on all of them be able to do them without you know failing and i think whenever i went through the game I, I did do them without failing i didn't i didn't go for perfects because the continues don't matter i mean not that i ever really needed to use continues but you know i mean that's that's why you would get the perfect for that continuation this is kind of overkill I, I feel like they give you a lot of lives as is And then again, in Origins, it's like, you just, you have infinite lives. You can eat dirt as much as you want. But, now, get the blue spheres. That's where it's at, man. I was really happy when they put that in uh, Mania. Although, I have to admit, I absolutely suck at the UFO game. Like, I am terrible if somebody wanted a good laugh all they'd have to do is watch me try that i am horrendous i don't know how people do it like anybody that can do that ufo game from cd like I, I i salute you because i don't know how the hell you do that i don't absolutely nuts I mean, I get the idea, I get what you're supposed to be trying to do, but I can't actually do it. I couldn't even really do it in Mania. As much as I'm, I'm ashamed to say it, I had to have somebody help me with Mania. I just, I don't know what it is, but me and UFOs don't mix. That's all there is to it. I ain't ashamed to admit it either. I mean, hell, I'll do the bonus level from the original Sonic game before I do the UFO one. And, uh, those bonus levels from Sonic 1, ooh, god, did they suck. You had very little control. Alright, let's, let's climb up here. <clears throat> the ones in this game aren't too bad. You, once you get used to them anyway, they're not too bad. I think, besides Get the Blue Spears, it's not in any of these games. Um... But, like, if I were to go to, like, Sonic Advance, I know, like, that's that's really reaching back to a game that'll probably never see the light of day again. Um, I like that little hoverboard mini game where you're trying to get the rings. That was... Why am I doing this? I could just climb this wall. I'm... I'm retarded. Alright, let's do this. It's like, I'm Knuckles. What am I doing here? I feel about as smart as Knuckles now. He's rubbing off on me. But, I, you know, said jokingly, I gotta say, Knuckles probably 
my favorite character in general. I do like Tails as far as, like, you know, gameplay mechanics-wise. I mean, being able to fly is just busted OP. And yeah, I mean, he kind of just absolutely sucks other than that for the most part. But, you know, like, I got all the emeralds for him in this game, and it's like, oh, by the way, he doesn't, he doesn't go super. And I'm like, are you kidding me? Like, why did I waste my time doing this? And then I thought, you know what? Sonic 3, he didn't transform either. Unless you had the Sonic 3 and Knuckles thing going on, and you got all the super emeralds, and then he's like... The most powerful character ever. <laughs> he doesn't even have to fight. He just makes the animals fight for him. Which, I mean, that's a pretty sweet deal. I must say. Yeah! Tough boss fight. I didn't think I was going to win that one. God, that was close. Oh yeah, no, Hyper Tails, or I guess he's just super, I think, I, don't, I can't remember, I think it just says he's Super Tails once you get the Super Emeralds, if I remember right. But yeah, no, I mean, he's absolutely ridiculous, you just stand there, he's like yawning because he's bored of standing there, and meanwhile you just have little creatures killing, you know, anything Robotnik throws at him. It's like, alright, well... That happened. He goes from like zero to absolute Chad. Yeah, the flickies. Dude, speaking of flickies, not gonna lie, kind of disappointed that uh, Sonic Spinball wasn't in this and uh, Sonic 3D Blast. I mean, maybe, maybe they just want to pretend those didn't exist, or there wasn't enough time. I don't, I don't really know, but I would have been, I would have been cool with getting those. I think I only beat 3D Blast once. It's just such a long game. You have to know what you're doing. Oh yeah, no, it was definitely fun. It took me a while to kind of like wrap my head around the whole 3D thing because like the way you jump and you have to land and, you know, like guess where you're going to end up, you know, it, uh, <clears throat> it took a little bit of practice to say the least. But yeah, it was definitely a fun game. It is like a maze. No, that, you know, that is exactly the right word for it. Like, every level is kind of like a maze. And there were puzzles, too, that you needed to complete to get through uh, some of the levels as well. And then if you wanted to get the emeralds, that was a pain in the butt. You had to pay everyone off to do the bonus levels. Which, those weren't too hard. They were just kind of awkward feeling. To me, they were anyway. But the uh, the final boss for that game, I actually really liked it. <clears throat> I thought the, the design for the level was cool, and I liked the music for it, too. It's really good way to kind of end that game, in my opinion. I thought I was going to eat spikes for a second. I'm not going to lie. Actually, before I lose my rings and feel silly, I'm just going to transform. You just have to be careful in uh, this zone because there's that one place. If you fall down, I think it's in the first act, though. But it's like if you fall down in it, there's no way out. Well, at least if you're Sonic. Knuckles could probably... Well, not... Oh god, what the... What the hell? Wait a second, what just happened? What is this? I don't remember that. I don't remember that from the original. Hey, what's up? 
How's it going, Zare? I, I hope I said that right. This is kind of cool. So this is this is the level I think that they didn't actually put in the game. So what? I, I fell down and luck sacked into another area. This is kind of cool. Yeah, I don't think that was in the original. That's cool they added that. I, I honestly didn't even know that was a thing. That is so cool. I remember the uh, listening to the, the music from the menu for this game and seeing the music you know or seeing yeah i saw the music uh-huh no listening to the music and i was like man where is that like what is that for and i heard there was something you know like it's supposed to be a, another zone there but I never thought i'd actually see it in here gotcha this is really i like i don't know and like <clears throat> I kind of said toward the beginning of the stream, I really like the backgrounds in the Sonic games. I think they're kind of cool. You got some, like, waterfalls and stuff going on there. Oh, no, okay, that's not going to squish me. That's good. Wait a second. Ooh, got a loop-de-loop -loop here. Like, uh, I think Sonic Mania, and of course it was a more recent game, but the backgrounds in that one were really awesome. Because it really kind of, I think, I think the backgrounds kind of tell the story, right? Because there's, there's not a lot of, in these, these older games, well there's not any, rather. It's not that there's not a lot of, there are, there is, wait, did I just like, do a loop? I think I, I think I went backwards. Um... But the backgrounds kind of help tell the story of what's going on a little bit. You know, where you're going, where you're at, you know, maybe even, like, what's what's to come. Oh, my God. There's, like, a... Is that, like, another place to... Go away, Bat. I don't know. That's kind of cool. I'm really enjoying it. I, yeah, my first uh, couple of times uh, playing through the mines there, I did not run into this. Oh, uh-oh. Oh, God, he's gonna... He's gonna play an instrument at me. Oh, what are these? Oh, snap. Um... What? Yeah, I don't... Oh, okay. So you make him... Oh, that's the mechanic. That's kind of cool. It kind of reminds me of... Uh... Oh, my God. Hydro City, kind of. Ooh, a big old bomb. Okay. I guess uh, the only song he's playing is his swan song. That was cool. That was really cool. What a pleasant surprise. That is my first time ever being there, seeing that. All right, good old oil ocean. Everyone's favorite zone. It's actually not that bad. I, I definitely hated this one a lot more when I was younger. I don't know why. I think it's just, it's, I don't know. It's just not as interesting to me, I guess. But it's not a hard level, or a hard zone, rather. <clears throat> I don't know why there's flying seahorses, though. I mean, I get it's oil ocean, but why are, why are they flying?
Can I just... I... Okay. Apparently, I'm not allowed to climb there. <laughs> they said, no, screw you. You do it the right way. I don't know if it would do that in the original or if it's just the remake, but I have noticed that I've gotten squished in places I probably shouldn't be getting squished. At least I don't think I should be. But... Oh, man. I remember, like, back in the day, if I see one of them, I'll, I guess, <clears throat> I'll point it out, but, you know, it used to be the coolest thing ever to find, like, the cheat menus and stuff, right? Because these games all had, like, level select and everything, and there was supposedly some kind of glitch where you could go super after getting stuck inside of some kind of thing on this level. I don't know if it was a BS rumor or there was actually anything to it, but I know I never got it to actually work, so either I was doing it wrong or it was a BS rumor. Because, you know, everything on the internet's always true, right? <clears throat> I like those little, uh, <clears throat> I don't even know what you would call them. Are they cannons? I don't, I don't know, but they're kind of cool. I like when they throw stuff like that in a game, just like, uh, just like an, oh, come on. Don't shoot me, man. Uh-oh. Oh man, there's a star thing. Let me go back and get that, even though I'm capped at 999. Totally need it. <clears throat> All right. Dude, it's like, I could almost run past it because I'm going so fast, but I just can't quite get past one of those fans. <clears throat> I mean, for all the bigger those fans are, those are some pretty darn powerful fans. It kept Super Knuckles back. Heck, they keep Super Sonic back, probably. Oh. Oh. Those things right here. So this was supposedly, if you got inside of one of these, you could hit something and it would make you super. I don't think I believe it, but, you know, that was, that was the rumor I read on the internet back in the day. <clears throat> I think they were pulling my leg. Oh, come on. Yeah, pretty much once I get the emeralds, I don't really care about keeping my rings. Because half the time I don't even care if I go into super mode. I only get the emeralds for the ending. What? Wait, what just happened? No, Knuckles! Why? Why, Knuckles? Why are you glitched? Knuckles! Hey, Tails is reacting to my... My trying to jump and move. Oh, God. <clears throat> I think I'm fighting all of the glitches today, folks. Why would you do this to me? Alright, I guess we're restarting the level. <clears throat> That's a new one for me, too. I don't think I've ever seen that. Ever. That's crazy.
Uh-oh. Oh, oh no. Wait. Wait a second. I got I went into the wall. I'm I now I'm tempting terrible things to happen, but can I get in this wall? That's kind of that's goofy. All right. I'm going to I'm going to end up getting myself in some real trouble if I keep messing with this stuff. I'll probably find a glitch that deletes my system 32 folder or something at this rate. Dude, what happened to your computer? Yo, I was in a glitch in oil ocean. What? I have a feeling, though, that spot I was in, <clears throat> you could probably get inside of it with whatever character. I wonder if I can go this way. Should I even go this way? I might even be backtracking. Well, it takes me up, so yeah, I don't... Gosh darn you, seahorse. I hate those things so much. I think those are the reason why I didn't like this level. Those seahorses are annoying. The octopus robots are kind of bad too, but seahorses by far, man. Because they chase you through walls. <clears throat> I mean, I know that's a spike, but, like, what is that even supposed to be? Like, if you think about it, right, you know, realistically, I get it, it's a game and, and there's level design and stuff, but, like, who would <clears throat> who would design a place like this at all? Alrighty, we'll play this one normal instead of cheesing it, which I'm okay with. Ah! <clears throat> I had a feeling it was going to do something like that. No! My shield is gone. Wow. I don't think it's supposed to do that too often, and it did it twice in a row. Unless Knuckles is just special and he gets the, uh, he gets that treatment. Poor Tails, just, just constantly dying. But he's immortal, so it's okay if he dies. <clears throat> One thing I wish we had in this game was a Knuckles and Knuckles mode, just for the memes. Oh, those starfish are not cool. Now, Metropolis Zone, as much as I like the music for this area, I hate the level. And if I remember right, because, I mean, it's been a long time. Ooh. Yeah, there's three. Ooh. <clears throat> okay, we're transforming. We're transforming. I'm not messing with that. Oh, yeah, there's Praying Mantis, guys. That is true. This game probably couldn't handle Knuckles and Knuckles. Oh, really? That, that was, ooh. I'm sorry, Knuckles. <laughs> it wasn't supposed to go that way. If I go that way again, I need to be careful not to get smushed. Those crabs are kind of annoying, but I can just fly over them. <clears throat> no, my rings. Gosh darn it. Oh my god.
We are doing all of the bad this time. And uh, there I just failed into success, so I'll take that. Gotcha. Oh, of course, there was a, a spike trap there. <clears throat> yeah, this zone is not one that I'm super duper familiar with, because back in the day, you could not save your game, and when I did get to play Sonic 2, I'd get to, like, the first act of this, and then somewhere there have to stop. Like, some of the Sonic games, I know the levels very well. This one, not so much. Which is another reason why I wanted to play it here tonight, and just kind of see everything. I really like that, um... <clears throat> Uh-oh. No! You get hit by something and fall like 20 stories, but you know, you're perfectly fine. Otherwise. You speed run the game. Oh, that's pretty cool. What's, uh, what's your best time? Out of curiosity. Oh my god. <clears throat> uh oh. No, I didn't want it. That wasn't how that was supposed to go. Wait, can I? No, you know what? I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna ride it all the way down. 25 minutes. Oh, that's still pretty darn good, in my opinion. It's better than uh, what a filthy casual like myself would do, that's for sure. I'm definitely not beating this game in 25 minutes. <laughs> yeah, I think the only, like old genesis sonic games that i'd know well enough to maybe be able to get through kind of fast would be like sonic 3 or sonic and knuckles you know the reason why i really got that far you know i know those so well is because the games would save so i could always pick up from you know roughly where i left off gosh darn that thing But yeah, no, that's pretty cool. Some people are really good at speedrunning games. I've seen some speedruns of stuff. It's crazy. Because those people have the levels absolutely memorized. Cool. I don't know. Maybe it's the nostalgia talking. I kind of wish they made Sonic games like this more. That's not to say that I don't like any of the, the 3D ones. You know, Sonic Adventure I thought was actually a really good game. Adventure Battle 2 was good. I like Generations. Actually, you know, I like a lot of the 3D ones, really, at the end of the day. But, I don't know, these old 2D ones, it's like, they got their own, they got a different feel, you know? I also like how they, at least for most of the levels, they give you multiple paths you can take. 
to get through the level. Yeah, what am I doing? I could have been transformed. Are we going up? We're going up. Oh, did your controller break on you? Oh my god. You know, again, why am I bothering with this? I can literally climb walls. And I'm like trying to play normal. <clears throat> oh man, that sucks. Oh, that's good. That's good. I know I bought a controller here not too long ago myself. I don't know, they just... Ah, I guess controllers never really do hold up that well. Because I remember back on the Genesis, I went through so many controllers, it was ridiculous. Although, I think a big part of that was my fault. Because uh, as a kid, you know, I would be uh, dumb and not move the console. So the way I moved the console was to jerk the controller to pull the console, you know, to me, right? Which is very bad for the wires. Um, and needless to say, I broke a lot of controllers. But I know, like, these Xbox controllers and stuff they have, or the generic, you know, kind of like Xbox-looking controllers, these things break down constantly, and it's like... <clears throat> I'm not even doing anything crazy. Like, I've seen, I've seen people take their controllers and, like, get really ticked off when they're playing or something and just, like, throw the thing across the room. It's like, I'm not even doing that kind of stuff. That's nuts. Oh yeah, I, I, I couldn't imagine trying to play this on a keyboard. So I bet speedrunning would be very hard. I mean, the game was, you know, made to be played. Are you kidding me? On a controller. And uh, that's just how it's gonna, you know, work out better. Oh, don't murder me, Mr. Mantis. Oh, he's just sitting there. He can't do anything. He's like, well, I lost my arms. Can I do this or will I die? Yes, I can't do that. All right. I didn't know if I was going to get pinched there. See, I'll go like, I'll go through like a couple of controllers a year at least. It just depends. I've been... It just really depends, I guess. Like, some of these just seem to break down a lot. Like, I do a lot of shooters, and, like, I have issues with the trigger buttons wearing out prematurely. Or, like, with the wireless controllers, I'd have problems with it just, I don't know, not, not picking up anymore. I don't know if, like, the sensor got burnt out or what, but... Oh, I bet it would be. Well, yeah, if you're playing games like this, yeah, you're more likely than not going to be using your D-pad. Now, I could definitely see it breaking down. <clears throat> yeah, anytime you've got, like, buttons that are used a lot, those, yeah, they'll definitely break down. I remember that this wasn't a controller per se... It kind of is, too. Uh, the old Game Boy Advances. So, I... No matter... Oh, I might be in a bad spot here. Am I going to live? Are you going to kill me? No! I'm going to die. Shoot. Well, it is what it is. 
I just gotta get good. But anyway, yeah, my Game Boy Advance, I used to play a lot of, uh, The Legend of Zelda, Oracle of Ages, and Oracle of Seasons. I think those are probably my favorite Legend of Zelda games, at least, you know, that kind of style. You know, not... <clears throat> but the select button would always... Oh, oh no. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Um, um, oh, nice, they made it. Knuckles OP. But yeah, I went through so many select buttons because you'd hit select to open up your menu and everything. And Oh, I didn't get wrecked. There's another, up, oh, up, oh, ah. Uh... Sorry, Tails, you're going to have to fall down. Oh! Gosh darn it. That thing in the background almost looks like a face with the two lights that blink the same and then the other one's open. There's something kind of like that in, uh... The Death Egg and Sonic and Knuckles, too. They have, like, a thing in the background that looks like a face. I think it was... I think that's where I saw it. That or it was Scrap Brain Zone. I'm trying to remember now. Might even be both, to be honest. I got four rings and a boss to fight. Let's... Oh, ten rings. All right, we got this. Yeah, I hate this one. Tails, you hit him for me. You're the one that can't die. You freak of nature. Uh oh. We're down to the wire. I'm sure there's people that can beat him without getting hit, but. Oh my god. What was that? He's just like, okay, I'm gonna shoot lasers now. Like, why didn't he do that to begin with? That was so much more... <laughs> Alright, then. Now I get to see what's after this zone. Sky Chase Zone. Hale's giving me a ride here. Ooh. Like a, I don't know, like a pterodactyl thing? What the hell is that? Ooh, combo. There's a turtle. With a smaller turtle riding it. That's, at least Tails is doing a pretty decent job following me. Uh-oh, wait a second. It kind of feels like he wasn't going to be under me there, and I'm kind of worried about that, if I'm being honest. Oh, they drop... Oh, oh, they drop spikes. That's not cool. You can... Oh, well, that's good to know. I don't want to do that. Oh, what is that? That is a... The hell? It's a rocket. 
spaceship thing. Oh, oh. These guys got faster. Oh, I'm bad. Shoot me. Shoot me. Well, they only shoot once and that's it? That's not very efficient. Why would he design something like that? Yes, I'm going to make a robot that only shoots once and just flaps in the air. Uh-oh. Tails? I will press F in honor of Tails. Oh, this doesn't, does that fire hurt me? I hope not. Oh, never mind. I'm just not going to make the jump. Those are some crazy lasers. Can I get up here? Yes, yes, I can. Knuckles for the oh, 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 oh. We have Commander Chicken. Oh, oh, I was about to jump on that. I'm glad I didn't. Now, that could have ended horribly with my death. Uh, okay, we can go up. Let's go up. That's not sketch at all. Wait, why are there TVs with rings just kind of chilling up there like that? That's, that's kind of weird. Oh no. <gasps> oh, I thought I was going to die for a second. <laughs> Holy shit. I was scared. It's like, this is how it ends, huh? Knuckles gliding. Oh no! That was mean. I wouldn't even want to do that as Sonic. Jeez. Uh uh. Alright, there's a. What is this? Oh! <clears throat> This kind of rem what? What is? Whoa! What? what the hell is that thing? That kind of reminds me of uh, that mini boss encounter in Flying Battery Zone Act Two, right before you fight the boss. Except you can actually kill that one. Oh, there's a life there. Wait. Oh, oh my god. What? What? I don't understand what just happened there. So, like, I accidentally walked off. Tails saved me. It looked like I thought Knuckles grabbed onto the spaceship, but then he's he's on the... I gotta watch that... Re Knuckles, what? <laughs> what? No! What the hell is that? Alright, I, I, I gotta ask, is that what's supposed to happen there? <laughs> Was I supposed to do something? Because <laughs> clearly, I wasn't supposed to fall there. Ow! Oh, it's gotta be open to hit it. Oh no! He's still... Wow. Really? Don't kill me! That's so... That's not cool. Alright, he's dead. He can... 
Okay, so... I don't know, does Knuckles grab onto that? Or, like, what is... I feel like it's actually working right this time, because Knuckles just kind of, like, fell off before. And I have no control over him, so... Yeah, I think the game glitched terribly there for me. Yeah, okay, this is this is what's actually supposed to happen. We are good. So, I just want to point out, how does Knuckles breathe? Actually, how is he not, like, burnt up in the atmosphere or anything, like... What a legend. I get no rings. I think I vaguely remember watching somebody here. Isn't there like a big mech? Oh god. Oh. No! Okay, he does that. He, like, kind of jumps, so I gotta go under him when he does that. Gosh darn it. But he didn't jump that time. Oh my gosh. I gotta be careful with this dude. That is a really ugly looking Metal Sonic if I do say- Oh, I can just hold on to the thing! Are you kidding me? Okay, I can't jump too far behind him or I get cut up. <sighs> I guess giving us a ring was too much for them, huh? They're just like, no ring for you! No! <gasps> no! Okay, I can't hold on to that wall. I can hold on to the other wall. All right, all right, we're going to do it this time. We're going to do it this time. I hope. Nah, nah. Oh, we got a lucky hit there. Ah, you can't reach me! No! Are you kidding me? Maybe I should just go for one hit, but I got, I was successfully able to hit him a couple of times there, so I don't know. I've met my match, perhaps. Alright. Hey, I beat him. Oh man, we can't catch the fat guy that runs faster than us. Oh no. Um. Okay. What do I do here? I don't think I can jump high enough to... Uh, I don't... I don't... Okay, like, where's my opening? Because I'm pretty sure those arms are going to stab me. Okay. Hey, okay, like... Oh, no! He threw his arms at me. Ooh. Oh, I gotta do this again? No. No. I really wish they gave me a ring here, but I guess it'd make it too easy, right? Gotta fight 
Metal Sonic Mach 1 a couple of times. Oh, okay, I can't spin into him. I don't bounce off of him. I just go through him. Shoot. The list of things I'm not allowed to do is getting significantly longer. Okay. 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 I am not good at this one. At all. No! <sighs> I knew that wasn't going to go well. Shouldn't have glided. That was my downfall. What does this guy take? Like 10 hits? No! Oh, what? How did I not die? I mean, I'm not complaining. <laughs> How did I not die there? Catch the fat guy! That's faster than us for some reason. Okay, I can hit him there. Oh my god! He shoots both of them! That's terrifying. But I might have something going for me there. As long as he doesn't shoot his arms randomly, I might be able to just kind of play the range game with him, unless he's got other tricks up his sleeve. Yeah, he can't reach me. <laughs> Get good, Robotnik. Get good. I wonder if that's like an official strat for this fight or something. I don't know, I still jump just in case. I just kind of expect something to screw me over. I have no rings. I'm not in a position to take risks. Oh my god. Oh, and he's gonna walk backward. Under oh yep. Oh my god, my hands are sweating so hard right now. Knuckle uh -huh. <clears throat> You'd think he would, like, try a different strat. Like, nah, 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 I'll keep doing this. But then again, I mean, there's a reason why he's never ultimately successful, right? He gets outsmarted by uh, furry woodland creatures. Oh my gosh. Dude, I don't believe it's that easy. This is a final... Wow! Is that it? Is that actually it? That must be... Wow! I think that's it. 
Knuckles just flying through space, through the atmosphere. What a legend. Wow. That was cool. <clears throat> that was a good game. That was a good game. It was nice getting to play through it there. So there were definitely a few occasions there. I had a, a bit of a rough spot. I think Metal Sonic was harder than uh, Robotnik's little mech at the end. That mech is just so easy to cheese. I also feel like Sonic has more opportunities to attack because he can jump higher. He might be able to jump over the arms. I don't know if you are necessarily supposed to do that, because that strat looked really simple. I'm glad I got that on the first, well, second try, I guess, because, uh, yeah. What a good game. <sighs> and this guy here speed runs this in 25 minutes <laughs> i can't even imagine i can't even imagine oh my goodness I don't know, what should I do next? I never really played Sonic CD either. Maybe I'll give that a shot. I don't even entirely understand that game. I know you can go between past, present, and future or something, but I don't know what the point is that you're doing. One thing I also like about this too, it works really well on the Steam Deck, and I can guarantee that a hundred percent because I was playing this on the Steam Deck earlier, and uh, it's amazing. It really is amazing. Love that thing. Oh, man. Let's see. Oh, and there goes the death egg. Crashing into Angel Island. Robotnik's is very angry. Like, no. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like the little animation. I like these. Actually, I like those little animations that they uh, put in the game. Man, that's cool. I don't know what order everything's supposed to go in. Does it go Sonic 1 and then CD 2 and 3? Or is it 1, 2, 3, CD? I think I, I, think I finished... I think I finished my playthrough I did earlier on here. 
if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, of course, did Knuckles, did Sonic, Tails, I got Sonic. I don't think I get any other combinations. It'd be cool if they let me do a, a Knuckles with Tails in this game, but they didn't really modify it from what I can tell for that anyway. I don't know. Do I start a new one? Do I? What do I do? I don't know. I can even go back and play Sonic 1. I don't know. What should I... What should I play as? Yes. Of course. Knuckles. Just doing a quick and dirty run here. I'm not going for perfect. I just don't see a reason to. So when you do a speed run, do you try to get all the emeralds too? Or are you just like trying to get through it as quick as you can? Oh, it actually takes control of your guy and moves him back. That's right. Not that I kill him, but, you know. Let's get this emerald. Oh, 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 oh,
<clears throat> See, I think there's one more bonus ring in this area. Er, no, no, not the last one. Exact one ring. Ah, oh, Knuckles, you're too OP. Alright, we'll take the low road. <clears throat> kind of wish I had a fire shield, but it's what it is. Dead. Now, one thing that's cool about these games is Knuckles takes completely different paths because he's Knuckles. Well, I shouldn't say completely different, but they're pretty different. There's a fire shield. I don't remember if there's any bonus rings now. I know Sonic gets one, like, right off the bat. So, kind of hoping there's one down here. Knuckles can get, because it... would be doing me dirty. Doing my boy Knuckles dirty. He doesn't need those emeralds. All right. Hey, let's try a. Uh... This is my favorite one. I love this bonus one. By far the best out of all of them. You just get so much stuff. Oh, shoot. No! Not being bad! There we go. Eh, I guess I don't really need those. Usually the good, good stuff is up here. Like that one up I don't need. I usually prefer when they give me the big uh, stack of rings. But I didn't get it this time. I think they did Knuckles dirty. Oh, ow. What the? Really? They just did that to me? So what? You can go backwards? I don't understand the point of that. But okay. Okay. There's not even a point to taking that spring because clearly you have to jump or you have to climb. Jump. Is there anything? No, there's no bonus rings. I might have to wait longer to get uh, Super Knuckles. That kind of sucks. So I think Sonic gets at least two bonus rings in this level. I hate this one. This is my least favorite bonus level because I almost always get Robotniks in the slot machine. I'm just going to take myself out of there before I lose everything. Not that it really matters, but yeah. Uh, there's nothing down there. I wonder if you can do debug mode in this game. Or 
or in this version of it, I should say. Yeah, we're like, they just totally did Knuckles dirty. He gets a really short level with no, no bonus rings whatsoever. No, no, oh, gosh darn it. I knew I wasn't going to keep my rings. Oh, what did I just, why did I glide? Why did I glide? That was dumb. That was so dumb. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, that bridge is gone. Oh. Oh, since it's always on the screen, it doesn't uh, come back up. That bridge. I see. But I think they used, in the old version of it, if you made it so the bridge was off screen, it would keep like dropping back down. And what's funny is, you know, Knuckles takes out that bridge to kind of screw over Sonic. And there he's just like, yeah, actually, that's the way to go, so I'm just going to go down. So what was he actually accomplishing when he did that to Sonic? It doesn't make any sense, actually. Oh, man. Let's see. Oh, we're 8 o'clock already. I... Yeah. I love that. That was just great. Oh, man. And there's one bonus ring. Yeah, I think Knuckles is going to be waiting a while to become super. Well, I missed one of the rings there because I was I was too high. I was too high. I missed that ring. Nah, took the wrong path for it, but that's fine. Should get most of them. Might be able to uh, finish it in Marble Garden. Worst case scenario, I could always do it in Carnival Night. It's not really a big deal. As long as I get them before uh, the end of launch base, which is definitely going to happen. My lamp just went out. And now this level looks really bright to me. I'll take my emerald, sir. Thank you. Think it goes up the left? Yeah. Oh, it wasn't. Gosh darn it. Can't even. Knuckles, why you jump so low? Oh, 
Oh, hey, I hit him. I'm gonna try that again. No, I failed. Hey, I got him. <clears throat> I don't know. I think I might call it there for the night. I gotta beat feet. But anyway, thank you everyone that stopped by. Uh, hopefully, maybe if I uh, play this some more, I'll see you again. But as always, take care. Have a good night. But for now, this is Agent Ice, signing off.